Hey everybody, my name is Gavin and I love horror. After 10 films in the series, some of which are some of the worst horror movies ever made, it's time to reboot the Hellraiser series. Hulu's upcoming Hellraiser series has been kind of mired in controversy since it was announced. They said that Jamie Clayton would be playing Pinhead and Jamie Clayton is a woman. What? A female Pinhead? How, how can that be? What? Pinhead has to be a man. It has to be Doug Bradley. People were weary of a female Pinhead, even though a lot of the production photos that have come out so far have looked incredible. And no matter how bad people may think this movie is, there's no way it can be worse than Hellraiser Revelations. There's literally no way. But today we finally have the first trailer for the upcoming Hulu Hellraiser reboot. So let's see if it will show us pleasures beyond our wildest dreams or if it's going to tear our soul apart. Oh, the trailer starts now. That's nice of them to let me know, even though I already like knew. Beautiful. Oh, yes. Isn't it? Mm. Puzzle box. It's really nice. Did they redesign it? You can hold it. Oh, they did redesign it. It's a different puzzle box, like a puzzle it? thing. It's a puzzle. Puzzle thing. <laughs> That's what I go with. And it's almost finished. Keep going. <laughs> so if I solve it, it looks like the I thing from Batman prize? Forever that the I Riddler do. uses to control people's mind. <laughs> I don't love the redesign. Uh oh! I hear them chains are coming. <laughs> mm. It was just thirsty. Yeah, love me some Clive what Barker. It has six sides, six configurations. Mm. It opens up <laughs> and it cuts you. Oh God! You don't put your finger in it. And then they come to collect. <gasps> okay, I'm digging it. Oh, I like the Cenobite design. Oh, Chatterer! It's time. Oh, snap. Greater delights. Yes. Wait. We wish to see you proceed. Oh, man, I'm digging the voice. Feed it. Yes. Their blood. Oh. Their pain. Oh. All for us. Yes! Work it, girl. More. Work it! Yeah! Okay! Hellraiser, yeah! Okay! October 7th, boom, let's do this! I was not prepared for how good that looks. That looks incredible. I love the atmosphere. I love that it has that Hellraiser 1 feel. I love the tunnels, just that, that blue lighting coming through with the, with the dust. This looks super good. Hulu hit it out of the park earlier this year with Prey, and that was also done by 20th Century Studios. This is also being done by that same studio. I think Hulu could be two for two this year on horror remakes slash sequels because that looks incredible. I think freshening it up with Jamie Clayton as Pinhead was exactly what the series needed. I love the designs of the Cinnabites. I think they look so cool. I love the reimagining of Chatterer because Chatterer is my dude. Like, I love Chatterer. I don't know what it is about him. Just like, that's my Chatterer impression. But I love that. And it does look like it's going to be violent. I love the voice that Jamie Clayton is doing as Pinhead, the Hell Priestess. I'm I'm pumped. That looks incredible. I think Hulu has another hit on their hand, and I think we're going to be turning to Hulu for a long time for our horror movies. I think that looks fantastic, and I think anybody who still hates after seeing that, you're going to hate regardless. And if you hate it, boy, do I have a puzzle box uh, that you can solve. But what do you think? Are you a fan of this? Do you think that this is going to be a good reboot of the Hellraiser franchise? I'm digging it, as you can tell. But let me know what you think in the comments below. Also, who is your favorite Cenobite of all time? Which Cenobite really speaks to you? Chatter speaks to me. Are you a Butterball fan? Or are you like CD face man from Hellraiser 3? Let me know in the comments below. As always, would greatly appreciate if you leave a like for this video and subscribe to the channel. I really do appreciate every little bit help. So please hit that like button and please hit subscribe. Would really, really help me out. But until next time, no tears, the waste of good suffering. <laughs>